today we get the lay tile. Enough with all the laminate laying and cleaning of the subwood floor. But you start with a nice clean floor like this and all your fiber rock lay. Now you want to get to this. When you start laying tile, you get to see all the beautiful tile. And I showed you a couple pictures here of what we've laid already. But we've got a few things to do in order to lay this on the way. And I wanted to start by showing you some of the tools that you use. We've got a straight bar that he uses to set the tile, make sure it's straight all the way. You've also seen a couple little rakes that he rakes the, uh, I call them rakes, with a uh, rake the mud with. In the background you see a green mesh and you see him, uh, that's where he's uh, filling up all the seams so there's no cracking later. And right now he's setting a chalk line. This chalk line is very important because about every two or three rolls of tile he'll set this chalk line and that's how he keeps it straight. Here's a close up of that mesh I was telling you about. This is what he fills in all the seams that are gaps in between the fiber rock. That way you don't have any movement. You don't have any cracking later, and that's very important. As you can see in this um, video clip, what he's doing right now is he's continuing on that tile I showed you earlier, the big bulk that he had laid. He keeps them going straight to the wall, keeps it all in one direction, and he lays them down one at a time following that chalk line and you can see at the, uh, next to the tile, he has that long straight metal bar. And that metal bar, he will keep moving down further and down further until it's all the way against the wood, the uh, library rack and back. And he'll just keep, that's how he keeps them going straight. You don't want them to, to start moving or going in a swaying pattern. You'll really be able to see that when you look down. Right now he's laying the mud and the way he lays it, there's like a, almost like a comb teeth on one edge that will set, and I'll show you a picture of that later. And that allows when the tile sets in, it really grabs and sticks, and that's what kind of keeps it from moving. So he just continues to lay this tile, one tile at a time, going straight into the wall. And pretty soon, this is where the tricky part gets. This is easy right now. The tricky part is when he runs out to where he doesn't have enough space to put a whole tile down and he's going to have to start cutting tiles and that's where it gets real tricky because they're easy to break and they're hard to cut and you know for all you woodworkers out there, wasted wood is one thing but wasting tile and trying to cut porcelain tile, uh, to me it would, it would be even, even a lot harder. So he continues to lay him. He's cleaning the area while he constantly cleaning the area. I don't think I have a clip of it, but he has a he carries a driver drill driver with him. And all the screws that are down, he when he starts an area, he makes sure they're all nice and flush. He doesn't want any screws popping up at all because later they could crack the tile if they, you know, if you step on it and they're pushing too high. So he's constantly adjusting the area as he goes along. Right now he's making a mark because he's going to make a cut and have to put that kind of like a little, uh, almost a rectangle cut so it'll fit around the fireplace. And he made that cut, you can see it, and it sits in just perfect. And once again he just continues to, he's constantly adjusting constantly pressing on the tile, making sure they're firm. He's constantly checking the gaps in between each tile. And that way, the further he goes on and the further he goes on, that line keeps straight. If you notice the, on the far left, the nice long metal bar, he's continued to just slide that down to the wall. A few minutes ago, it was a ways from the wall. Now he's filling in the last gap before the wall, getting it nice and clean, making sure everything's filled in, there's mud everywhere, and then he's gonna have to cut these tiles. He's gonna have to measure them. As you'll watch here in a second, he's gonna measure it. He'll cut the end off, and he'll come in, he'll fill it, and it'll fit in perfect. And you're gonna have a nice, tight seam of tile all the way around that wall. I wanna get a close-up here for you, 
and show you how it looks, you can see the little finger combs, the little like, uh, what I call the way he takes the trial and runs it around. And that's the part that apparently makes it really easy to set the um, tile in so it really grabs. And he's gonna have to make the cuts all the way around that corner. And that's, uh, that's a pretty, pretty hard little uh, turn to make. And I'll show you a, a final snap of that. And that's all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed it. My name is Ronnie Sutton. You're watching It's a Wood Thing. Please share, subscribe, and I'll see you soon.